What? Meow, meow, meow. Good night, in there. Let's play good night, Meow. No, it's not that long since you were last fed, Sam. No, it's not. It's like three hours at most. But, you know, starving to death. Just absolutely starving to death. Meow. Meow. Oh god, another cat? Goomba? I'm not sure I would survive. Meow. Especially if it was as talkative as Sam. Right, top tier game. Nice. No carrier. Also very nice. Meow. Meow. I think I might have to give him at least a few biscuits. It might distract him. Oh god. I mean, I don't know I've told this tale on stream before, but it's probably not been for a long while, but um, my now late uncle and not late aunt, I don't know if there's a neat way to say that, but um, at, at, at the height of their cat ownership they had I think 13 cats? Yeah, and visiting their house was always quite the experience. And it wasn't on purpose especially. I think they started off with like one or two cats and then basically their sons would keep turning up with strays and people would go, oh yeah, you've got cats. I can't take care of this one anymore, so you'll have it, right? So apparently they just couldn't say no and ended up with a lot of cats. Lots and many. I can't imagine having that many cats, but somehow they managed. And somehow the cats didn't all murder one another. There we go. Citadel to start with. I mean, I think, yeah, their kitchen, they basically gave up trying to keep cats off the worktop, so... Um, I don't know if it was the most hygienic house ever. <laughs> they kept them out of the upstairs bedrooms. But as you can imagine, the amount of litter boxes they needed... Their bathroom was basically half litter boxes. I think I think my uncle would have liked Sam though. I know Sam, you're starving to death, I know. Wow, both of my torpedo launchers Okay. All right, Relic. Hope you've enjoyed yourself. Be able to catch the rest on the VOD for two weeks or however long it lasts. Oh, oh hello. Okay, well, now there's a cat on the desk. You're aware I can't see through you very well, Sam, or do you just not really care? Meow. Yeah, I know. I know you're there. I can see you. Can't see through you, but I can see you. Meow. I don't think I have a secondary build on this captain especially. 
No, 5.8 kilometers on secondaries. Ah! No, no, pointing at the screen! Oh, hello, we found out where one of their destroyers is. Just run out of range, though. Ah! No! Sam! No! No, leave the cables. No, get down. Get down. Cats. Cats. Why did I think this was a good plan? Which way's the Nelson guy? Possibly a risky turn in terms of torpedoes, but oh, what have we got? I've been deliberately holding fire so the uh, Akatsuki had to guess. Nelson, hello Fubuki. I am playing rather aggressively here, I suppose. Right, that is a very broadside Nelson, but well, these guns, who knows how it's going to go. Oh, well, one sit up. Slightly better than I was expecting. Oh, Bayern, this is the reason why I turned around, you know. Nothing's <laughs> printing himself a new ship. Sam's running around like a nutter. Unless we had some destroyer scouting ahead of us. Did the Akatsuki go down? No, the Akatsuki is still running around somewhere. Well, let's put the concentration a bit more towards the middle now. Oh, where's the kamikaze? Come on, it's worth firing at. Nice, I go. The foos are aiming at me, okay, good to know. Boop! Oh. 
So it's very useful of our other gunlays now to go and die in exactly the same spot as the Bayonet. It's very, very useful. Hundred K already as well. I didn't even notice that. Which for this ship is not bad going overall. Right, it'd be nice if our destroyers are doing a little bit of a better job countering their destroyers. The the Buscovites are, I can, you know, like, you can't really blame them. It's got horrible stealth. T-22 and Minikaze, on the other hand, are actually quite reasonably stealthy. That synops not coming out. Oh, Hatsuharu! No! 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 And the Buscovites are as well. Still alive, but only just. Good grief. Right, here's where slightly longer range secondaries might actually be useful. Sam! No! But, <sighs> Sam! No, out of there. Do we do? Everybody would stop dying, that would be nice. Be slightly wary of his torpedoes, of course, but at this range, there's a very good chance of just blapping him out of the water. Check what that synops doing. Or I could just get three overpens, sure. Well, now you decide that you've got guns, T22. Okay. Exactly 440 points each. Can't really go that way. A bit too risky. 120k damage though. Definitely not too shabby. Destroys managed any kills? No, okay. It'd be nice to know where that synop is. Okay, he's still there. High caliber, not bad.
I've got a heal going. Oh, oh, nice. Okay, back to AP. That's very useful. That's one of the more dangerous ones left alive. Well, we could finish off that Fuzo. That would be jolly nice as well. Fubuki's whereabouts is rather unknown right now. Come on, this food's our solo health. That's gotta be worth killing. I don't wanna pull out, like this is slightly risky, but I don't wanna pull out and get blocked by the Koenig and the Sinop. Potentially. I think I'm putting some work in, in this one, you know? Kinda of feels like that. Right, we now have a pretty decent lead of points. Which side of this island do I want to try poking? So I do have my torpedoes. Let's go around this side, I guess. One health, one health, one heal left. Oh, spotted by the T22, okay. And we're also now capping the mid. Let's put a fighter up briefly. T22 is going to be that arc there somewhere, I'm guessing. Right, it's not worth the risk trying to push them when we're this close on points. And though it is tempting to YOLO in and get the torpedo damage. I don't want to risk eating a broadside of T22 torps. Come on Koenig, I hid behind that island for so long. Come on, give me some damage. That'll be a spoil sport. A bit more. Nothing spectacular though. So the T22 is obviously around here somewhere. Yeah, I'm not overly impressed with our destroyers in this game, but we're winning, so I'll take it. Clear that new. Oh, they killed the Synop. There we go. Well, I think that might be a highlight. It was a pretty decent game. Probably the best game we've had this evening in terms of damage. 140k. Not bad. Uh, out of the destroyers, that T-22 that survived was the only one that particularly tried to do anything. But the enemy two surviving destroyers weren't especially effective either. 
Matt Koenig did just hide the entire time, pretty much. Still though, good result. 